I wonder, is it safe? Oh, you ain't. <laughs> the map's probably safe, but you definitely not. <laughs> the side eye. You. Ah! <laughs> the deeper, bombastic side eye. I'm going to the changing room. Hopefully there's not cameras in there, but who knows, am I right? I love how I'm shorter now. <laughs> Hi you guys and welcome to the Shan Caravan. In today's video, we're back with more Paper Mario and Thousand Year Door. We just defeated Grubba and we're back with the X Notes and Shadow Sirens. <laughs> Beldum. Tell me, what good are you? You still haven't taken care of that Mario character. Well, yes, sorry, but only because he's tougher than we thought at first. You do understand that we x knots must open the door first, do you not? <laughs> well, rest assured that I will definitely nail him next time. We've prepared a weapon that will bring him to a quick and certain end. I trust your words, though I rapidly lose my patience. Just leave it to us, sire. <laughs> Let's away, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to say, really. Hi, <laughs> oh, boy. Back to the princess. Hmm. No doubt about it, I'm officially bored. <laughs> Goodness. Those awful x nuts things haven't been back to ask about the map. I wonder, is it safe? Oh, you ain't. <laughs> the map's probably safe, but you definitely not. <laughs> Oh my, that must be tech again. Can I open these? No? Alright, cool. <laughs> Let's get out of here. On our nice little stroll down our industrial boulevard. Straight across from tech's room. You would think they'd want me not close to, like, the most important computer in the world, but eh. What do I know? <laughs> Hello, Princess Peach. You always call me in without warning, Tech. What is it this time? <laughs> More dancing. <laughs> I apologize. I would like you to go to where Sir Grotus is and ask him something. What? What do you mean, go ask? I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. You are the main computer here, right? Why is there anything you don't know? I am unable to know things that are not entered into my CPU or otherwise recorded. That is why I want to know what Sir Grotus is thinking about this issue. But even if I try to go see him, they'll catch me and send me back to the room. That is true, but you will find a soldier room one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, please obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. You will go see Sir Grotus looking like a soldier. <laughs> the side eye. <laughs> really? <laughs> you mean I'll be disguised? Uh, I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? Ah! <laughs> the deeper, bombastic side I just like, bruh. All right. You imagine correctly. All right. Fine, I guess. Well, so what do you want me to go ask the Scrotus? I will tell you. That's not ominous. <laughs> what in the world is Tech thinking? I mean, honestly, he sure has a weird computer. You don't say. Oh, it's green now. Oh, jeez. Oh, is this the elevator he wanted me to go in? It's the only one here, so I guess so. Oh, this place is so weird. I thought he said one floor up. Alright, I guess he knows what he's doing. Please wait just a moment. There are currently soldiers in the vicinity. Huh? So said, wait, just hold on a minute. Dang. Hold your horses. Now, Princess Peach, it's the room with the green lamp very near where you disembark the elevator. Yeah, all right. I'm assuming here. <laughs> 
Please change here, quickly. The soldier's uniform should be in a locker. You just want to see me change, don't you? Goodness. <laughs> hmm. Oh, is this the uniform? Am I supposed to wear this ugly thing? Yes, that is correct. Uh, I'm going in the changing room. Hopefully there's not cameras in there, but who knows, am I right? <laughs> I don't know about this. It's awfully tight and it kind of smells a bit. Ugh. All sweaty. Whew. Who knows how, but I got into it. I can barely breathe though. Ah, I love how I'm shorter now. <laughs> I bet I look perfect. I love this. <laughs> I love any time in a game where you can play as like an NPC. <laughs> Can I talk to people? Hey, oh. I wasn't sure who's talking because they were both like doing their little jig. <laughs> hey, Slacker, what part of do not leave your post don't you understand, huh? Hmm? What? Come again? Are you on your break? Well, it's fine. Carry on. Yeah, I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a get out of here. Where am I supposed to be going? I hope this is right. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, I don't know why I'm scared. Like, I'm nervous as if I'm actually there. <laughs> Excuse me, Sir Grotus. Yes, what is it? Speak. Uh, well, it's about Princess Peach. What do you plan to do with her going forward? Did he ever actually tell me what to ask, or am I just making this up? Hmm. Something is wrong with your voice, x Not. Cool. Perhaps I have a throat lozenge. No, well, never mind. No, about Princess Peach? I have no interest in what that woman has to say. Just keep her locked in the room. But don't ever, ever treat her roughly. You understand. Tell the others as well. But, uh, wh why in the world are we keeping her here then? That's none of your business. Don't forget your place, you impudent worm. Concentrate on getting the legendary treasure. That is all I require of you. We ex nots need that treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world? Legendary treasure? What are you blathering about now? Mm -mm. Something is odd about you. N n nothing odd. <laughs> uh, so, Roger, or whatever, uh, please excuse me. Okay, all right, Princess Peach, you was uh, asking a lot of questions there. Goodness. Oh, that was unnerving. All that stuff about conquering the world. Talk about creepy. Wonder if that has anything to do with collecting those crystal stars. Time to get out of this. Off with this thing. So does that mean that Tech doesn't even know like what the grand plan is? He's just doing what Sir Grotus is telling him to do? Oh, good old pink dress, my favorite. Would I ever wear anything different? I better get back quickly. Oh boy. I'm still like anxious from that. <laughs> Tech, you terrible machine. So your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Of course, after all, I was built for that purpose. <laughs> so nonchalant, like, what, well, duh. <laughs> Conquering the world? How could you? Princess Peach, allow me to ask you something. Do you like the world you live in? There are many problems in the world, many sorrows. Do you like such a world? Getting deep tech, all right. Of course I do. Nobody likes everything about the world, but I, I love the good parts. There are many sorrows, sure, but there's also joy. Is that so? Tell me, will the crystal stars help you conquer the world? And what's this treasure? I am afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited by Sir Grotus. Well, but... Never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. Tech, let me use your communicator. Mm. He's like, mm, this might have been a bad idea, but uh, I suppose I can allow that. Please use the communicator. I might have messed up. 
I'm gonna send this this instant. <laughs> the message has been sent. Please then, Princess Peach, you have had a busy day. Go back to the room, please. Oh, okay. And she's like, are you sure? I'm so bored, but okay. <laughs> yeah, I wanna talk, hang out, play some Jenga. <laughs> Good night, Princess Peach. Oh, tech. Back here. Oh. <laughs> that, that thing's humongous. Everybody, hide now. Save yourselves. Stupid cheating Mario. Who would have thought that a fool would be in Glitzville? <laughs> Did you say something, your rudeness? Oh, uh, no. Nothing at all. As far as you know. Hey. Did you see those bite-sized shrimps? What were those things? Those were some puties. One of them should know about the crystal star. They fear you, so they're all hiding. Let's find them all and get the info we need. Eee! I love any chance. <laughs> Eek! Flee! I love any chance I can play as Bowser. Y yikes! This guy is big and bad and large and in charge. Hex, yeah, I am. Eek! You scary Mr. Giant Bad Breath Monster. You know what? Uh, don't don't worry, Petunie. Your big brother is here. We'll get through this. Aww. Where y'all at? This looks like, uh... Oh. Be gone! <laughs> the face. You're one of them, aren't you? One of the evildoers. You want our crystal star. Ha! See? I knew it. This ugly thing knows where the crystal star is. Tell us. How rude. Ugly thing? How dare you, you wretched crone? I'm the great pony elder. It's really hard to do two voices that are very similar. <laughs> Eep! My heart! Don't startle me like that. I'm too old for this stuff. You're both too old. It's hag versus hag. Awesome. You're both too old. Mm. <laughs> your Lord Bowser. You look as if you just sat dying to say something. Uh, nope, nothing. Let's move on, shall we? You elder hag thing, where's the crystal star? Don't try pulling rank again. Your answer, not your age, will determine your fate. Hmm. Hag thing. Honestly. In any case, you're too late. The crystal star is gone. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> That's right, you rude thing. We gave it to the mustachioed man named Mario. He said he was collecting legendary treasures to rescue some princess. What do you call her, Princess Pinch? Yeah, he was off to save that lucky lass. It's Mario, not Mario. And it's not Princess Pinch. Her name is Princess Peach. But you <laughs> Senality is besides the point. The princess and treasure must be connected. Mario's trying to get it all. Treasure, princesses, does this greed never end? That jackal, both Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars belong to me, to me. If I find him, I'm going to finish him off once and for all, I swear it. <laughs> all righty then. <laughs> Already back in the action? My goodness. I feel like we just, uh, just finished. Goodness. So now you must leave. Oh, yeah. I understand. If you must, you must. We won't delay you. I hope you succeed in finding the rest of the crystal stars. Good luck. Gonzales, I want to tell you, Rockhawk ain't gonna fight dirty anymore. I'm gonna hit the weights, take some vitamins, and win the title fair and square. And I'm never, ever going to lose again. Remember, when life rocks you, you rock back. <laughs> Listen, G-Money, thanks for everything, man. You're the nicest dude I ever met. If you ever need it, I got your back. Me, I think I'm going to chill here and improve my skills. Kincaid's back, baby. 
<laughs> I'm glad that they're okay. <laughs> and it's all thanks to you, dog. You my boy, Mario. Now that Grub is out of the picture, I'm going to take over running the Glitz Pit. <laughs> if you ever decide to return to the ring, just come back. I'll keep your spot open. You have tons of fans, and they'd absolutely love it if you made a comeback. Anyway, think it over, okay? And travel safe. Oh, off we go. Back to the um, Thousand Year Door, I guess. Ooh. Yes, we have the three crystal stars now. We're rolling. Let's head back to Rogueport, Mario. Goodbye. <laughs> I will say, um, you can uh, come back and become a fighter again, but I think you start back at the bottom. And you have to work your way up, and um, I just don't feel like doing that in this playthrough. <laughs> I'd rather get through the story. <laughs> Very well, folks. Please watch your step as you board. Back home we go. Well, I guess this isn't home for Mario, but back to our hub we go. <laughs> It's just a broken lamp post. My god. This is supposed to be the nice side of town. Lordy. Mm -hmm.